There's more news on the economy tonight. A new report from the National Urban League has some sobering numbers on the state of black America getting hit particularly hard and especially on the jobs front. Our report tonight from NBC's Mara Schiavacampo. Book editor Rakia Clark was laid off 14 months ago. Now home during the day, she sees firsthand how unemployment is affecting her Harlem neighborhood. I thought it would be a lot more quiet. I thought everyone would be going to work. And these, these are adults that are on the corner. And, you know, a year ago they had jobs. It's the same story in African-American communities all over the nation. With the national unemployment rate standing at 9.7 percent, it's a staggering 15.8 percent for blacks. He pulled me to the side and told me that, you know, business is slow, we have to lay some people off. I've been looking for two years. In today's State of Black America report, National Urban League President Mark Morial paints a grim picture. Black America is suffering. Uh, the recession has had a very tough impact. In Muskegon, Michigan, about 30 percent black, even the head of the job placement center is letting people go. I had to lay off a couple people and had to cut hours. Though President Obama this month signed a $17.6 billion jobs bill, the Urban League says it's not enough. We need the kind of powerful response to the jobs crisis that we saw to the banking crisis. They're urging a more targeted approach, funding for job training, a summer work program for teens, establishing credit for small businesses, and tax incentives for creating green jobs, all designed to empower the neediest communities. It's a spirit embraced by Rakia Clark. She's freelancing now and planning her future. I've been able to sort of reevaluate what I want to do next. Working through challenging times where finding a job is the toughest job of all. Mara Schiavocampo, NBC News, New York. The sluggish economy has hit minorities especially hard. Today, in its annual State of Black America report, the National Urban League says the unemployment rate for African Americans is nearly twice that of whites. And when it comes to health care, blacks are nearly twice as likely and Hispanics three times as likely to be uninsured.